Okay, these are the materials we need. Uh, glass jar and uh, a card, a paper card, and some water. So what we're going to do is we're going to fill the glass jar with water. I'm going to lift up the jar and I'm going to take the card and place it on the jar. Now I'm going to do a flip. Flip it up. Now it's inverted and this tub here is to catch the water that falls out. So what's going to happen now is I'm going to hold, I'm going to change over my hand so you can see better and I'm going to hold a glass jar full of water with this hand and gently remove the other hand. So shall we do it? Let's see what happens. See, as I take off my hand, all the water stays in the glass jar just held by this card and the reason so is all our science teachers tell us is the air in the room is pushing against the card like how it's pushing against our bodies so it's pushing against the card and that is stopping all the water from falling down okay so i can slowly start tilting it it still holds in place as long as the card doesn't slide off you can see there's nothing stopping the water now, as i pull out there you go all the water fell off now we're going to do the same experiment where we don't have any air so that is going to prove this experiment now where do you think we don't have any air air is everywhere air occupies space it's inside the house outside the house everywhere except in deep space so we can't go to deep space so i'm going to take you to a special uh, arrangement that we have it's called a vacuum chamber so we're going to do the same experiment inside a vacuum chamber and see what happens this is a classic experiment showing children that air exerts pressure there's water filled in a glass and a paper card underneath holding the water there's nothing underneath the glass it's just the pressure of the uh, air that is holding the water up in the glass so it looks like it's defying gravity so normally the air is pushing on the card up here so it's keeping it up there so today we suspended this glass inside a vacuum chamber now we're going to pull out the air and see what happens next we're going to start the vacuum pump that's the vacuum pump there See at one point the air could not uh, was wasn't enough inside the chamber. Please stop it, and this is the reading of the vacuum pump now. 